Creating a pollinator-friendly garden isn't just about beautiful blooms. It's a vital step towards supporting the health of our ecosystems. Bees, butterflies, hummingbirds, and other pollinators play a crucial role in pollinating plants, which in turn helps produce the food we depend on. We'll explore the key steps to planning and planting a garden that not only dazzles the eyes, but also provides a safe haven for these essential creatures. Understanding pollinators' needs. Before diving into planning, it's crucial to understand the specific needs of pollinators. They require food, nectar, and pollen, water, shelter, and breeding sites. By providing these essentials, you'll create an inviting and sustainable habitat. One, site selection. Choose a sunny spot for your garden, as most flowering plants require ample sunlight for healthy growth. Consider the size and layout of your garden and plan for both flower beds and open spaces. Two, selecting plants. Opt for a variety of native plants that offer continuous blooms throughout the seasons. Native plants are adapted to local conditions and are more likely to attract and support local pollinator species. Choose flowers of various shapes and colors to cater to different pollinators. Three, plant diversity. A diverse selection of plants ensures a steady supply of nectar and pollen. Include flowers in different sizes and shapes, such as tubular, daisy-like, and flat-headed blooms to accommodate various pollinator species. 4. Flowering Seasons Plan for flowers that bloom at different times of the year to provide a consistent food source. For pollinators from early spring to late fall, this ensures their sustenance throughout their active periods. 5. Water Sources Create shallow water sources like bird baths or small ponds. Pollinators need water not only for drinking, but also for regulating their body temperature. 6. Shelter and nesting. Incorporate diverse vegetation heights and structures to provide shelter and nesting sites. Leave areas of bare soil for ground nesting bees and provide logs, branches, or bee houses for cavity nesting bees. 7. Avoid chemicals. Minimize or eliminate the use of pesticides and herbicides in your garden. These chemicals can harm pollinators and disrupt the delicate balance of your ecosystem. 8. Maintenance and observation. Regularly maintain your garden by deadheading spent blooms and removing weeds. Observe the visitors to your garden, identify the pollinator species, and adjust your plant selection if needed. 9. Educational signage. Consider adding educational signage about the importance of pollinators and the role your garden plays in their conservation. Encourage others to create their own pollinator-friendly spaces. 10. Record and celebrate. Document the plant species, pollinators, and their interactions in your garden. Celebrate the success of your pollinator-friendly space and share your experiences with your community. Planning and planting a pollinator-friendly garden is a fulfilling journey that contributes to the well-being of our environment. By providing essential resources for pollinators, you're not only enhancing the beauty of your outdoor space, but also participating in a vital effort to support biodiversity and ensure a thriving ecosystem for generations to come.